Ever feel like your money has a mind of its own slipping through your fingers before you can even blink? Yeah, we've all been there. But here's the good news. It doesn't have to be that way. The world of personal finance might seem like a wild, untamed beast, but trust me, it's more like a domesticated pet. You just need to learn how to handle it. And the first step? Understanding the art of budgeting. Now before you roll your eyes and click away, hear me out. Budgeting isn't about depriving yourself of all the fun things in life. On the contrary, it's about making sure you have enough for those fun things, while also taking care of your needs and saving for your future. Intriguing, right? But wait, there's more. There's this thing called the first rule of budgeting. Sounds important, doesn't it? Stick around and you might just find the secret to taming that wild beast we call personal finance. What exactly is a budget and why does it matter so much? Well, in simplest terms, a budget is a financial plan. It's a tool that helps you understand where your money is coming from, where it's going, and most importantly, how you can better direct it towards your goals. Think of it as a GPS for your finances. You wouldn't embark on a road trip without a map, would you? Similarly, navigating the financial journey without a budget is like driving blindfolded. Now, the significance of budgeting in personal finance cannot be overstated. It's like the foundation of a house, without it the entire structure your financial stability can crumble. Budgeting helps in tracking expenses. Ever wondered where your paycheck disappears every month? Well, a budget tracks every penny, ensuring your hard-earned money isn't just slipping through your fingers. Next, budgeting plays a crucial role in setting and achieving financial goals. Want to buy a house? Plan a vacation? Retire early? These goals require money, and a budget helps you allocate resources effectively to reach these milestones. Lastly, budgeting helps manage your cash flow. Simply put, it ensures that your inflow, that's your income, is always greater than your outflow, your expenses. This is where the first rule of budgeting comes into play, spend less than you earn. Now I know what you're thinking, that's just common sense. But you'd be surprised at how many people struggle with this fundamental concept, and that's why understanding and implementing this rule is critical. It's the cornerstone of successful budgeting practices. So, we've got our foundation. Now, let's get to the nitty-gritty, the first rule of budgeting. Remember folks, budgeting isn't about depriving yourself, it's about empowering yourself with knowledge and control over financial future. So, buckle up, and let's dive deeper into the world of budgeting in the next segment. If you're finding this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more budgeting tips and tricks. The first rule of Budget Club, spend less than you earn. Simple, right? Well, if it were, we wouldn't be having this conversation now, would we? The essence of this rule is to live within your means. That's right, it's about resisting the siren song of that shiny new gadget when your old one still works perfectly fine. It's about saying no to that impromptu weekend getaway when you've got bills to pay. It's about understanding that just because you want it, doesn't mean you need it. Now implementing this rule is not about depriving yourself of all earthly pleasures, it's just about being smart with your money. Start by tracking your income and expenses. Know where your money is coming from and where it's going. There's no better way to understand your financial health than to see it all laid out in front of you. Next, prioritize your needs over your wants. This doesn't mean you can't have what you want, it just means you need to take care of your needs first. You know, the boring stuff like rent, groceries, and utility bills. Once those are taken care of, you can start thinking about that vacation or that new pair of sneakers. And finally, set yourself some spending limits. This isn't about restricting yourself, it's about giving yourself a guideline. It's like having a map when you're exploring a new city. It helps you know where you're going, and more importantly, it helps you know when you're about to go off track. So, there you have it. The first rule of Budget Club is, spend less than you earn. Not so scary when you break it down, is it? But remember, knowing the rule is just the first step. The real challenge is in sticking to it. Great, we've got the rule. But how do we stick to it? Well, stay tuned, because that's what we'll be diving into next. Sticking to a budget can be as slippery as a buttered eel. Fear not, we've got some tips to hold on tight. Now, the first rule of budgeting is like a sturdy lifeboat in a stormy sea of expenses. Spend less than you earn. But how do we keep this boat afloat amidst the waves of enticing sales and unexpected bills? Well, let's dive into some practical tips. First off, create a budget plan. This is your financial map, guiding you to the treasure chest of savings. List down your income and expenses. This will help you understand where your money is going and identify areas where you can cut costs. It's like playing detective but with your finances. Remember, needs come before wants. It's the financial equivalent of eating your vegetables before dessert. 
Sure, those shiny new shoes are calling your name, but do you need them? Or can that money be better spent on something more essential like bills or groceries? Now let's talk about discretionary expenses. These are expenses that are nice to have, but not necessary. Like a daily coffee from your favorite cafe, or that streaming service you only use once a month. Identifying these costs can help you trim your budget and save more. Next, find areas to cut costs. This might mean taking a packed lunch to work instead of eating out, or canceling subscriptions you don't use. It's like going on a financial diet, cutting out the excess to achieve a healthier bank balance. Don't forget the power of an emergency fund. This is your financial safety net, catching you when unexpected expenses come tumbling down, and trust me, they will. From sudden car repairs to emergency medical bills, life likes to throw curveballs. An emergency fund helps you handle these without derailing your budget. Savings accounts are also your budget's best friend. They help you put aside money for future goals, whether that's a dream vacation, a new car, or a comfortable retirement. It's like planting a money tree, nurturing it with regular deposits, and watching your savings grow. Let's look at a real-life example. Meet Jane. Jane was living paycheck to paycheck with no savings and mounting credit card debt. But then, she decided to take control of her finances. She created a budget plan, cut out unnecessary expenses, and started saving. Within a year, Jane had paid off her debt, built an emergency fund, and even started saving for her dream home. She's a testament to the power of the first rule of budgeting. All right, we're armed with strategies, but beware, there are pitfalls ahead. Even the best of us can stumble. Here are some budgeting boo-boos to watch out for. First off, underestimating expenses is like a banana peel on your financial pathway. It's easy to overlook small frequent purchases, but remember, a trickle can turn into a torrent before you know it. So keep an eye out for these sneaky money drainers. Next, we have the silent offender, neglecting to account for irregular expenses. These are expenses that don't occur monthly, like annual insurance premiums or car maintenance. They're like pop quizzes. They can catch you off guard if you're not prepared. So chalk them into your budget in advance. Another common misstep is setting a budget and forgetting it. Your budget is not set in stone, it's more like a living, breathing entity that changes with your life circumstances. So if you've landed a new job or welcomed a new member to your family, it's time to revisit your budget. Now let's talk about strategies to stumble-proof your budgeting journey. First, always overestimate your expenses. It's better to be pleasantly surprised than unpleasantly shocked. Second, keep an emergency fund. It's like a financial safety net, catching you when you fall. It can cover unexpected expenses or income loss. Third, make savings a non-negotiable part of your budget. Think of it as paying your future self. It's not just about stashing away money, it's about cultivating a savings mindset. Lastly, regularly review and adjust your budget. Keep it in sync with your life. Remember your budget is a tool to serve, not a master to serve. By sidestepping these common mistakes and employing these strategies, you're not just following the first rule of budgeting, you're mastering it. With these tips and tricks up your sleeve, you're ready to conquer your budget. Now go forth and prosper. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more budgeting tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.